Eyo ni ajeni aje watu wangu what's good manze good evening manze it's another Thursday manze you already know how we do this in GBS Art Club manze where we feature all forms of art manze you already know how we do this and today manze being a Thursday manze najua ume chill tu na unangoja ni kutole form kama kama mina kupeleka na ring so you already know how we do this manze Today ni me feature another incredible art ndani ya nyumba but kabla tuendele sana ujue ni nani yako ndani ya nyumba leo kwa B quiz nauliza do you really think like modeling as an art iko accepted na in Kenya na pia inakuwa supported so be part of our conversation manze hit us up in our social media platforms GBS TV Kenya pia unaweza ni reach ka advocate 254 then pia do hivi tuma your feedbacks your views zote to our sms line 2144 and then we'll get back to you kabla isho ishe so meanwhile kabla tuendele sana manze let's check this slideshow okay kwa keen sana you definitely know nikona nani ndani ya nyumba so ladies and gentlemen manze mr and miss wal kenya yo ajaje bro sana how are you eh poa sana congratulations manze <laughs> hi miss hi miaje poa how thanks are you thanks sana i'm fine thank you thanks for making manze thank you eh uh, so briefly ebu ambia wa say like when ni nani just in a few all right, my name is Franklin Asoyo. I'm the current Mr. World Kenya 2019-2020. Uh -huh. Yeah, right to miss. And my name is Maria Ovenya, and I'm the current Miss World Kenya 2019-2020. Hey manze, congratulations sana. Najwa si raisi manze. Awa se wato walikuwa wanadai. But finally you got it. Congratulations. So bro, first things first, like what's your inspiration? Like when did you start modeling and stuff? Um, I started modeling in 2017. Uh -huh. My first beauty pageant was Mr. and Miss Jacobs, uh -huh. and which I happened to win. Uh -huh. Then, two years later, this is my second pageant, mm. which I happened to win again. Mm. Yes. All right. Now, uh, for me professionally, I started modeling like about seven years, seven months ago. Oh, seven years. Hey, yes. <laughs> seven months ago. Hey. Yeah, and my first show was in May. Uh -huh. That was Miss Tourism Nyandaro County. I'm from Nyandaro County, by the way. Oh, of big which up was I, Nyandaro. Uh -huh. uh, I only made it to the top five, but I didn't take the crown. Uh -huh. And then this was my second beauty pageant, mm. and I took the crown home. Okay. Yeah. So apart from being Mr. Kenya Sai, like kuna other titles umekwanazo like before. Uh, uh, as I did, as I said uh, before, you I did two pageants here. Uh, I, I was Mr. Jacob 2017, 2018, uh -huh. and this is my second title. All right. Yeah. Pia yeah. wewe. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah, me too. For me, I don't have any current <laughs> yeah. apart from this. That's so, say, ningependa sana kujua, mm. like, as models, manzi, mm. ndo msea kuidentify first time when you model, I'm saying I'm going to characters, I'm as a model, so that I can check two first time, na na conclude when you model. Um, I believe, I believe uh. a good model stands out. Uh. Mm -hmm. Um, you can literally handpick a model from the street. By the way, mm -hmm. he or she carries out his or herself. Uh. You know, when you're not tembea, when you're not kula, when you're anongele some you know, yeah, uh -huh. things like that. Uh -huh. It's it's an all-rounded thing. You have to look nice, mm. dress nice. You have to go to the gym, mm. and talk well to people, things like that. What what when the gym kuna Anyway, Miss, according to you, like, msi ana faku po identify first time as a model. When you ana kulu anything about you. Wow, I think I'm a sema almost everything, yeah. but <laughs> definitely a model is somebody who's always to always supposed to be 
outstanding. Uh -huh. uh, your etiquette should always be on another level. Mm -hmm. The way you talk to people, the way you address them, mm -hmm. the way you, okay, when it comes to eating, how you hold a spoon. Cindy, <laughs> 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 uh -huh. see, see, that is true, Frank, yeah, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. And then how you dress, how you walk, mm -hmm. how you respond to various people uh. under different circumstances. Uh. Somebody can easily tell this is a model, mm. this is just a so-called fashion blogger <laughs> <laughs> or something of the sort trending on Instagram, yeah. Uh. yeah. So talking about modeling, okay, so under which category? Um, what do you mean by categories? Like uh, to call a commercial or something. Oh, oh. yes. Uh. Oh, um, there's there's two broad categories. There's beauty pageants and commercial modeling. Yeah. Um, most of the time, most models are in both. Yeah. So um, beauty pageant, like this is a beauty pageant, yeah? Oh, okay. it's, it's a good way of exposing yourself to the commercial world. Mm -hmm. So you don't don't get to choose. I just find um, a good opportunity yeah. and mm -hmm. run away with it. <laughs> <laughs> uh -huh. yeah. For me, what I can say is that yeah. Who you are, what you are, determines where you are supposed to be. Mm. If you are all fit and you are what the, the ambassadors are looking for, yeah. then definitely you are going to fall under the runway category uh. and you are also going to fall under the commercials category. Mm. So the runway is all about beauty pageants and high fashion. Mm. Commercials ni billboards, magazines, company activations, so on and so oh. forth. Yes. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah. Anyway, viewer manze, as you've heard leo to kona Mr. and Miss Wal Kenya and Dania Nyumba, you already know how you do this manze. So, any kamu kona maswali yote, keep sending them to our SMS line to double one double four. Pia, hit us in our social media platforms, GBS TV Kenya, we'll get back to you. Pia wata respond to kabla isho isha. So, yeah. getting back to you manze, as in kuna wase wengi wal kona contest this story, wacheki. Like nadai kujua, mm -hmm. okay, hii itaenda kuwa kufast. <laughs> <laughs> nadai kujua, <laughs> like, au jaka kwa industry sana modeling, yeah. ndio? Mm -hmm. Like, uli apply creativity gani? Mm -hmm. Ama nini ulikuwa nao unique, mm -hmm. yanyu ulifanya, u, yani, uka convince hao judges kukuselect as a, as a winner? Okay, first and foremost, I'm a very prayerful person. Oh. So I can say it is the power of prayers Sawa and God's God. grace. <laughs> and then another yeah. thing is yeah. learning that whenever you're doing something, you cannot do it for yourself. Otherwise, you're just egocentric and yeah. you're going to fail terribly. Mm -hmm. So whenever, when I stepped into the auditions and I got the confirmation message that I made it, I knew that I would stop having the mentality that I'm going to do this for myself, you know, get that prize, mm. travel all over the world. And I had to put the mentality that, mm. first and foremost, the saddest thing is that Kenya has never taken the crown from the Miss World competition. Oh, uh -huh. And personally, I feel Kenya, it's not like we don't have all it takes, right? But maybe there is that extra drive from within that makes them lose that opportunity. So I had to drive myself from within and be like, yeah, I really want to take this crown and I really want to make Kenya proud amongst other nations. Mm. So I feel that's what made me stand out mm. amongst other people. Of which you've made it. Congratulations. <laughs> Yo, bro, we able to ambia on a Um, what made me stand out? Yeah, I mean, another <laughs> <laughs> kina Bruce, walikuwa, kina Keith, yes. kina Saimo, yes. Sijui, what happened, yeah. manzi? Um, like I said, um, mm. God first, obviously. <laughs> God starts, I got starts, I got starts, I got starts. Yeah, God first, always. Yeah. Yeah. God first. Mm. But then you have to put your best foot forward in everything you do. Mm. And like she said, for you to put your best mm. foot forward, there's something that's, that has to be motivating you, yeah? Mm. So um, if what is motivating you is small, then what you're going to be putting forward is small. But if there's a big thing pushing you, it means your, the outcome will be bigger. So in me in mind, I had very big plans, which you're probably going to ask about later. But yeah, I had big plans. And there's a lot of things that were pushing me, bigger things. And mm -hmm. I had to stand out. Yeah. So Niliskia, who was she? Like, Kanza Dena's sister, Pia Likwa. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, sure, actually. Like, how is the feeling, Manzia DA? She was the first runner, actually. Yeah, so. first runner, Zah. Yeah. Anyways. 
<laughs> Bishara sana. Uh, so manze like so far ume planini like okay since you've received such a incredible titles mm-hmm. so me plan kudu nini like ku get back to people actually atujabongea who was behind your victory kwanza everybody i mean uh, before before the competition we had a two week boot camp uh, we we had people come in teach us a lot of things uh-huh. teach you how to walk teach you how to eat teach you everything full of you and how to smile teach you how to smile uh, <laughs> yeah so um the ho- there's there's a lot of stakeholders that mm-hmm. have brought, that have brought this thing together mm-hmm. and my gratitude goes back to all of them mm-hmm. because there's the the people owning this franchise are, are Ashleys and mm-hmm. they are the people who've managed to put this all together just to bring the youth out here yeah. so pretty much them my parents they supported me my parents sorry mm-hmm. um my friends supported me there's a whole lots of people yo yo mbogi yote mbogi sijui ni wapi lakini nilikuwa eh so nadai like you give a shout out to ule mali play a very big role kwa your victory all right so f- my biggest shout out to Ashley's for if why it not for them actually me and Frank will not be here right Thank you. Yeah, it's all under their courtesy that we are seated right here with these crowns on our heads and they made our dreams come true. My second shout out mm-hmm. is to our choreographers in the boot camp mm-hmm. and for real those people did a lot for us. Mm-hmm. I didn't know that I'm supposed to smile in a different way. <laughs> I didn't know that there is a way I'm supposed to sit in front of people. Uh-huh. I didn't know that there is a specific way that I'm supposed to address people as a queen. Mm-hmm. And so all and to them you know there are people who can just tell you this is what you have to do you just do this and become a queen and they leave you after that so it's for you to find out but for them they held my hand mm-hmm. all the of course they held everybody's hand mm. but god already had that yeah. one person yeah. right yeah. and yeah. then my last shout out last but not the least it's to all my fans to my family my guardians my friends yeah those people really turned out like big time for me mm. yeah Well, thanks viewer manze. Hope uko tuned kama kama manze una get to listen from the one and only Mr. and Miss Wal Kenya manze leo wako ndani ya nyumba. Minwell kabla tuendelee sana let's take a very quick break and we'll be right back in a few. Hey. Alaji. Oh my hey, young baller. Hey yo, now welcome back manze bado tuna proceed kama 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 dana. If you're joining us right now manze jua leo tuko na Miss and Miss all Kenya ndani ya nyumba manze keep sending in your feedbacks manze your messages maswali zenye mnadai wajibu pia zi direct to 07 uh, 78445505 so keep uh, be part of our conversation manze pia unaweza to hit in our social media platforms KGBS TV Kenya sawa so manze getting back to Miss and Miss all Kenya like Where so far we make kwa industry to say me modeling as uh, like six months ago mm-hmm. like can you mention maybe some of the challenges that you make to meet before ufike hapa mali uko sai oh wow yeah. challenges yeah. there are a lot but i what i can say that the greatest challenge is mm. always yourself Huh. because it's up to you to drive yourself to become the person that people want to see mm. and obviously the you know right from the word go <laughs> if <laughs> if anybody can show you a video of maybe when you nilikuwa ninatembea from the start you'll definitely say that eh huyu mse anatembea kaangamia i remember there was a time uh-huh. i was training and somebody achokosh told me najua uh-huh. unatembea kaa bata and i was uh-huh. like oh my god for how long am i going to stand this <laughs> so you see it has to be a, a drive from yourself to make sure that you you become that person that everybody wants to see and that person that should be chosen to be a queen among his other people mm. the number two challenge obviously was to keep fit kitambo i was so huge but right now i'm here 
and he's saying that yeah. I don't know. Um, you said I'm 35 kilograms. <laughs> 23. Are <laughs> <Yeah>. you 23? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But the greatest greatest challenge yeah. is always yourself. Oh. Yes. But so far, according to your uh, to your feedback, na na feel kama like only do I just conquer like cool. That's why I. Okay, ku overcome our say I think you had also a strong mindset so that Yeah. Eh kwanza mimi msaa kiniambia wewe unatembea aje. Wewe jamaa anaweza mchukia. Acha say tunatembea aje. Unatembea kaa bata. Yeah, that was the exact statement. Wewe msaa anatembea kaa bata. Yeah, that is the exact statement. Yeah. Like hiyo haiku ku limit but you need to keep moving. Yeah, yeah, because definitely mm. when you're told that you'll feel bad. Mm. Yeah, it's a must for you to feel bad you're human, yes. Mm. But if you have to stop walking like a bata you have to work hard, uh, uh -huh. Yeah, so that's what kept on pushing mm. me. Yeah, and I'm sure I right know if they see me walking, they mm. definitely be like, "Hey, uh, sawa." <laughs> but I think I was saying, you know, sometimes I don't want to bong. I know I'm not prepared for psyche, and so yeah. you approve wrong, sindio. Yeah. Of which you've done, eh? Definitely. So, bro, you know, some of the like challenges that you may put me, maybe you go to school. Je, what na juu amanze si raisi ku wase wote wendo na wakilisha. Yeah, some of the challenges. Um, like she said, the the greatest competition is always uh. you. You always have to beat your mental state. You always have to beat mm -hmm. uh. what you're feeling. Mm. The days you wake up like you don't feel like doing what you have to do, mm. yeah. but you always have to beat your mind. Mm. Yeah. So um, let's say for me, yeah. when I started modeling, uh, I used to be a scout, Kitambo. So oh. scouts walk. Yeah. With V like this, and in modeling you have to walk with straight legs. Yeah, yeah. you have to, your your legs have to right. point in front. Yeah, mm -hmm. so it was quite challenging moving from this to this. Yeah. In in I yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's difficult. Trust me. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So um, but as you go, as you go, as you go, you learn you learn new things. You learn you have to be fit. You have to learn how to walk straight. Mm -hmm. So I had to go to the gym. I used to be really skinny kitambo <laughs> i used to be bullied by the way yeah. bullied a lot so um if you let all that get into your mind you won't get to where you want to get mm. so always you have to beat your mind that's the greatest challenge mm -hmm. of which you did yeah or um, you're still I, doing yeah, i'm still doing yeah. <laughs> I, am, I'm, I'm, yeah. I always say you always have to outdo yourself yeah. mm -hmm. if you think you've done something great uh -huh. look for something great and do it yeah, yeah. All right, I got you. So, Miss, mm -hmm. like, nani ya mekuwa mentor wako before up to now? I'll take the question as who has always motivated me, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay. When I was 12, or rather when I was 11, I I have an aunt actually. Right now she's in her 30s, but when I was 11, she used to be a model. Yes, and I used to go a lot to her shows and I could see the amount of work that has to be put in for her to succeed, mm. for her to take a title, especially a first runners-up in any competition. Mm -hmm. And one thing she always told me is that the moment you step onto that runway, mm. give it your all, because it's either you are there for a question or you are there for a different category. So mm. if you are here this time, believe me, you're not going to get that time any other moment. Mm. So the moment you step onto that runway, give it your all, and it's not always up to the moment you get a chance to be on the runway. Any other moment, if you choose to be a model, then be a model right from the word go. Mm. Be somebody that even a stranger, a kikuja, at a just could pick point and they're like, I want you to come and work with me. Yeah. I want you to do this, this and that with me. I want you to market my product on the billboard. So she told me that it's not even about how pretty you are because, oh my God, there are millions of ladies pretty yeah. out there, right? Uh -huh. It's not even about how much you can give. It's mm. just about who are you? Mm. Who, as in, what is your mentality? Because ideally people look for your opinions. I, I remember Terry Mungai when she was, t okay, she was addressing us and she told us if she was to hire somebody, she, Okay, she's conducting interviews, and then different people come in with, uh, all of them are overqualified. Let me just call them overqualified yeah. from their papers. So definitely what she'll be looking for is your opinion. So definitely it's all about your mentality. Mm. It's all about your heart. If mm. you give everything your all, then you're going to make it. And mm. that's what my aunt always told me. 
Alright. Yeah, so she has always been Meanwhile, like kabla tuende okay. mbali sana, yeah. like we kuwakilisha 254, si ndio? Uh-huh. So like unafikiria wase watakuwa wakikukumbuka na nini like like okay apart from your age pia nasikia yo 18? Yes, I'm on, 18. Yeah. <laughs> wase wanafakuwa na kukumbuka na nini? Okay, definitely Okay, what you don't know is that there was a moment I was a uh, I was a victim of a skin condition called vitiligo. Oh, now I know. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it is the, the disease that makes your skin look extra white. Yeah. And it spreads merely when you step into the sunlight, it spreads. So I used to be a vitiligo uh, victim. Mm. And what there is is that there is no medication to that. You're the only person who can cure yourself. So. Mm. What I feel Kenyans will remember me mm. from that uh, is because um, I'm going to create awareness amongst other Kenyans that, yeah, mm-hmm. I'm going to create awareness amongst them that th- actually there's a scar, right? Mm-hmm. And these scars are actually what makes us beautiful in our societies, yeah. Mm-hmm. All right, I got you. So, Mr. Umekwakwa industry for quite long, like. Unaweza conclude aje so far. Modeling in Ali Pama. Ama bado. Unasema aje individually your personal views. Um it does pay. You can you can be a model full time. Uh-huh. Yeah, you can do it as a career. Uh-huh. Yeah, so it does pay. So if you want to be a model, a great one, you go for it. Mm. Yeah. Okay. I got you. So what do you think? What's your take about about Paying modeling in Ali Pama in two five four. Obviously, modeling pays, uh-huh. but it's uh, what I've been saying all along. It's it's all about you. Oh. If you're the person that the investors are looking for, you're going to earn. Mm. If you're just a lazy person seated over there, you mm. are going to suffer. Mm. Yeah. Yo, viewer, when you basu naskia modeling in Ali Pama, but. <laughs> Kumbuka, last time I hosted Miss and Miss KCA, walikuwa na sema like. Modeling somehow, I leave this. Bado hawa jafikia some of the challenges was you overcome so that we get to know that it pays. But mm-hmm. what what are your views? Like keep sending them to our SMS line, two double one double four. Do you really think modeling in a leaper? Napia, do you really think modeling as an art is accepted in the two five four? Napia in a supported. So Right about now, Maze, let's take a very quick break and we'll be right back with another incredible baddest segment in Ajita. Open mic, let's do this. JD on the track. Hey, yo, welcome back, Maze. Umeskias, can I be free? Sijui nini nini. Hey, Maze, minge kuwa rapa, Maze, minge wana shida. Minge kuwa muimbi. Anyways, Maze, keep us staying tuned up at VGBS Art Club, Maze, where we give you a platform to take you places, Kamaka. You already know how we do this, Maze. Na Kamaka, Maze, in studio, leo tukona Mr. and Miss, wal Kenya, Maze. Very incredible guys, Maze. They made all the way. Adi hapa hivi. So, getting back to you, manze. Mister. So, like, kabla tumalize show, ningependa yes. sana kujua. Okay, ladies first. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> ningependa sana kujua, like, uh, nini mekweki kumotivate all through, like, contesting, vitu kama hizo. Hakuna ile de, yanu mwai luzo opu seme, ah, acha tu ni achane story. Nini yu mekuanga kama motivation yako? First and foremost, that was one thing I had to accept and I had to program my mind that mm. in any way, because I know that I will win, that was one thing I always used to tell my mind. Mm. Because I know I'm here to win. Just always put in your mind that you're not doing this for yourself. Mm. And the moment you win, you'll have to be Kenya because out of the, is it 136 countries that will yeah. be contesting for the Miss World, yeah. I'll have to be addressed as Kenya, yeah. but not Wavinya. Nobody will know Wavinya. I even doubt anybody will know my actual names. <laughs> but I'll have to be addressed as mm. Kenya. So mm-hmm. that has always been my greatest motivation all through. Mm. That I'm not doing, I'm not working for myself. I'm working for my country. Yes. Yeah. Yo, getting back to you, bro. So like, uh, kuna mse uko inje, ni model. But bado, yani, akona yo passion na modeling. But bado, aja, 
ana hiyo yani hajapata sijui niseme ni platform ama nini unaweza bonga na umse unaweza mshow nini um just start just start um go we are human beings we 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 are born with nothing uh-huh. it's you to get what you want uh-huh. it's for you it's up to you to know how to meander so uh-huh. you just walk crawl uh-huh. jump run do whatever you can uh-huh. to get whatever you want to get i wasn't handed this on a silver platter it's not like i knew anyone uh-huh. i worked uh-huh. i worked uh-huh. to get here anyone can Mm. literally anyone can take that from me mm. so if you have the passion you go after it mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. all right miss like uko umepanga nini so far <laughs> like kufanya kenya kwanza nilisikia utakuenda london ku represent ama something of that yeah, kind yeah. yeah talk about that a little bit okay so after the competition which is done all over the world uh-huh. there is one major international competition among its other nations uh-huh. so the first obligation is to represent kenya uh-huh. outside in the miss world competitions uh-huh. and then of course after that are my own projects one of them is to create awareness among its people living in our societies that uh, people living with scars actually mm-hmm. scars they can be out of rape scars out of um, domestic violence uh-huh. and people living actually a skin condition can be termed as a it's not a disability mm-hmm. but it's more of like a scar and mm-hmm. these scars are actually what makes us beautiful they're what makes us more outstanding and they're what makes us i don't know extravagant yeah uh-huh. yeah so kumalizia bro uko na plans gani like una like kufanya kenya nini so far now that you are holding this such an incredible title as Mr Kenya uh, any time you come mm. to contest for Mr or Miss World Kenya mm. you should have a CSR project mm. so um f- uh, it has to be approved so mine is pending approval uh-huh. but we have great plans we have CSR projects i have like three she has has like you've had the skin the skin condition thing and others so there's a lot of plans that are still being put in place you know we just were crowned a week ago or oh, is it a week ago yeah. two days ago just some days, days. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah so we're still young but uh-huh. then things are moving fast yeah uh-huh. so in due time our projects will be out there uh-huh. yeah well i got you so i say bado and i expect manze wase kuwa unajua like nyinyi ku win ni kenya me win na kenya pia ina dai kuona you guys doing your thing one check so tukimalizia like wase wanaweza kupata wapi no social media platforms wenye wanaweza taka ukaeka role model wao ama yeah, oh, yeah okay. such like my social media instagram wa vinya underscore maria twitter wa vinya maria mm-hmm. facebook wa vinya maria everywhere mm-hmm. wa vinya maria uh-huh. yes yo uh, bro for me everywhere instagram okay. facebook twitter tumblr pinterest it is i killer place yeah, everywhere it is i uh. am frank e frank is frank i e y uh. frank e yeah Mm-hmm. So when you mesikia manze lot kuna the one and only Miss Ten Miss Kenya manze representing the 254 you already know how we do this manze so cuz ilikuwa me request and, and we did our best manze they are here so thanks sana for those who texted for those who requested now by the way musisa Miss Universe will be happening sindo it will mm-hmm. be happen yes eh uh, so mnaweza vote you get to ig kuna hapo hivyo au ma models wote details zote ziko hapo choose mwenye unataka manze you vote all details are there by then nilisikia <laughs> akothe yeah. eh? nani wa dota wa akothe pia na contest mm-hmm. so unaweza choose unadai kuvote ya nani so that later pia tutawa have up hivi in in gbs art club kama 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 da anyways manze thanks sana kwa ku join since tulianza hii show tunakubika up sana manze thanks for your cooperation in nini thanks kwa wale wenye umetuma so we are going to check them in a few and then we'll be getting back to you so meanwhile if you're doing any form of art make sure you hit us up in our social media platforms ka gbs tv kenya and then tutakuita hapa pia tukupe platform you'll get to showcase whatever you have in but for now manze 
tunasema bye. Bye. Thank <laughs> you. Thank you. <laughs> eh, yeah. ama ebu ongea ambi your last words to our viewer. Um, thank you. <laughs> thank you. Eh. <laughs> yeah. As a young young model, all I can tell you is that don't don't let your kids dreams go to waste. No. As a parent, it's up to you to nurture them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's my last words. Well, a very special thanks to the management, Mr. and Miss, <coughs> Mr. and Miss <laughs> Well Kenya, a very special shout out to CEO at a telecom, Napia to the one and only Ramsey Scott Designs. Mm -hmm. Anyways, thanks Anna Kwa to join. Let's do this again next time, same place, same time, different form of art. Ata nguo pia nita change tarudia. So, tupatane next week manze. Let's do this. Hey. Oh my young baller. Every 